Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're going to add two numbers with JavaScript. Oh, this is fun. Uh, number is a data type in JavaScript. What does that mean? It means like um, in JavaScript you have different sorts, sorts of things. You could have a word, which would be something like, um, a word would be something simple like a string, but then there's also a different data type. Uh, a word would be like a string, and that's what we call like a word in computer language. Um, in um, JavaScript, you can also assign numerals, or like numbers, to things. A number is a type of uh, data in JavaScript. And there's also true and false, which is Boolean. Anyways, we're gonna get into all that later. Uh, so let's try uh, two numbers using JavaScript. JavaScript uses the plus symbol as, a additional, a, as an addition operation when placed between two numbers. So for example, uh, five plus 10 is equal to 15. Um, so we wanna change the zero so that the sum will equal 20. <clears throat> okay, so if I look over here, right now, what happens if we run the test? We see it comes out, it should equal 20. It's not equal to 20. Sum should equal 20. Variable sum is equal to 10 plus zero. So what, how can we make it different? Well, we could change this to 10. I think this is the most easy way to go about it. So you just put in a one here, and now if we run the test, um, it should pass. Okay, cool. Let's take this back over to the terminal. So again, I'm just hitting uh, command spacebar and I'm going terminal. And then you get your terminal here. This window pops up. Uh, my terminal is kind of specialized uh, the way that it looks, but that's no problem. Now, once you have node installed on your computer, <clears throat> you can just hit node in your terminal. And now this little caret here represents the fact that you're in a, uh, what's called a REPL. So you're just in JavaScript. So you can say 10 plus 10 is equal to 20, right? Um, let's play with it a little bit more. So you could go nine plus 11 is equal to 20 as well, right? You could say, um, you could make a variable for nine is equal to nine. And then you could go um, nine plus 11 is equal to 20. Does that make sense? Does that help at all? I'm not sure. But just basically the idea is you could go 90 plus nine is equal to 99. This is how uh, JavaScript works, you know, uh, whatever. 1,000 plus one is equal to 1,001. And so this is the way they're trying to teach you in this lesson. Instead of doing 10 plus 10, you could go nine plus 11, and we're still going to pass this test because this variable, which is sum, still, uh, renders out to be uh, 20, which is what they're looking for. So that's what they're trying to teach you in this. I hope that me going into more uh, depth of the example is useful. Uh, let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next lesson.